this time, this season, there's even more of a buzz in the town. There's such a positivity about the club, the way the players have played, just the manager, everything. It's just so positive. I mean, obviously, you've been with the council now for a lot of years, and do you, do you think this is, is like you say, this is the biggest buzz you've ever felt around the town? From, from a business point of view and also from a, a fan perspective? Yeah, definitely, because I think, for me, there's a, a real feeling that we've been promoted, but it's not just about going up to survive, there's like, and, and can we stay up? It just feels like it's a completely different feeling, it really is. And the international interest as well, the way that Burnley can even become more global as a brand, it's just a massive opportunity going forward. Yeah, that's a good point. What does, what does that do for the town? I mean, you've got the likes of JJ Watts coming here, you've got Jordan North coming to DJ at the Royal Darts last night, I mean, that kind of celebrity exposure puts Berlin a map like we've never had before. Oh, exactly. I mean, I always think that people always think Burnley's a bigger town than where it is because of the uh, exposure we've had so far. This really will be global and we can all capitalise on it. All our businesses can capitalise on it. It really is a massive opportunity. So you going? Yeah, <laughs> I am. No, of course I am because it's like, well, I'm, I'm happy to be going because it's a new, new chapter in my life. But it's sad to be going, but I, I assure you, I will always have an interest in Burnley. Burnley's my second hometown, you know, so I'll always have that interest. I definitely will. But you couldn't be leaving on a bigger high, could you? No, definitely not. Definitely couldn't, no. It's, it's such a lovely way to go. I'm, I'm here for another two and a half months, but yeah, it's going to be hard to cap this over the next two and a half months.